guys <clears throat> got another amp here it's a woozy audio zk mt21 mini amplifier let's see if we can read some specs here uh, 50 by 2 for stereo 100 watt for sub and let's see 12 volt 24 volt input for power aux in has a subwoofer, subwoofer frequency adjustment, volume, treble, bass, and main volume. And it also has Bluetooth. And uh, it uses the TPA 311-16D board. As you can see here. I've already kind of put it together. The knobs and everything are, are usually on here. They, you have to put that together yourself. And, uh, yeah, it's a nice little unit. Um, I got this to replace my Lepi 838 amp because it had Bluetooth, and that's, you know, really what I wanted. Um, besides being compact, I mean, you can, I mean, this thing fits in the palm of your hand. So, as I said, it does come disassembled. I've already kind of put this plate together here with these little standoffs on it. But that's all I've done so far. But, let's see, here's some more specs. If we can read them let's see that's Bluetooth 5.0 the model is ZKMT21 uh, let's see 24 to 20 volt input up to 9 amps and let's see 4 ohm to 8 ohm impedance and uh, as it says at the bottom here, the higher the voltage, the greater the output. So, anyways, let's get this thing put together and uh, let's check it out and listen to it. Be right back. All right. Hopefully you guys can see this here. I can't get a good angle, but let's see what we can do here. Let's try to put this thing together. This is going to be your bottom plate here. Hopefully you guys can see that. This is your bottom plate. And it's just going to fit through these little holes here. One there, one there, one here, and one there. And then next you're going to put these risers up off these standoffs here that's pretty straightforward you're just gonna screw those on there just like so Once you get all four of them on there, this is what you're going to end up with so far. A little space underneath for it to breathe. Okay. And now we just need to put this top cover on. Okay. So, and then we just line it up with the top of the screw holes here. So. Let's get this set up. I don't think these screws could be any smaller. Okay. 
Just a Sorry guys, I'm trying to hurry, I'm trying to do this in real time here so you can see what it takes. It really doesn't take anything at all, it's extremely easy. It's just having big old fingers and working with these small screws, that's the issue. Okay, and if you see here, I put it on backwards. <laughs> so, this should be facing this way. Crap. Why didn't you guys tell me? Uh, let me pause this and just flip this around and we'll be right back. And just like magic, we are back. There we go. Nice. So, frequency adjust. I'm not sure what the crossover is on that. I don't know if it goes up to 200 hertz or what. Um, the subwoofer volume, treble adjust, bass adjust, and then main volume. To turn the unit on and off. What's nice about this is the Bluetooth automatically connects. It connects quite fast, actually. Um, so, uh, yeah, let me get all this hooked up and uh, we'll test it out. Alright, and we are back. So, let's get ready to play some music, get everything turned on, and uh, see what we get here. Turn it on. Nice click. Got the blue light. Some volume, and let's go to Bluetooth. Let's let it search. BT Woozy, yeah. and there we go. Let's see what we get. Oh yeah. Sub here.
sounds great. As a dual TPA 311-16Ds, it's a nice amp. Um, this the uh, BRZ Hi-Fi uh, TPA 3255 dual TPA 3255 is what just replaced this. But other than that, I love this little thing here. Uh, it works great. It pairs super easily. It, it's with just with this subwoofer uh, frequency adjustment, man, it gives you so much more control, and uh, you can get some good sound out of this thing here. I highly recommend one of these. I think this is only about $25 or so, if that. Um, it might be even a little bit cheaper now. I don't know. But all in all, this is a great little amplifier to use. Um, whether, again, for a little home setup, PC setup, you know, just whatever. Uh, I highly recommend that. Um, let's see if I can get another song going here. If, uh, let's see. One moment, guys. Okay, let's see what else we got here. Again, the Woozy Audio ZKMT21. Um, I hope I'm saying that right. Woozy High, Woozy Audio. But anyway, so you can find that on eBay, uh, maybe Amazon or or wherever else. Um, but yeah, I highly suggest it. And my camera just came out of the tripod. But yeah, I highly suggest it. Uh, give it a look over, guys. Woozy Audio ZKMT21, 2.1 power amplifier.